Apple's new M4 Mac Mini looks like a powerful piece of tech, but is it actually a downgrade? We're diving into what's missing in the new Mac Mini, and there's one key feature that might make you rethink everything. First, let's talk ports. The Mac Mini has dropped USB-A completely. That means you'll need adapters if you use older accessories. The power button is now on the bottom, so if you turn your Mac on and off regularly, this could get annoying. And remember those four Thunderbolt ports on the M2 Pro model? Now, there are only three. The Mac Mini is now smaller than ever, just 5 inches by 5 inches, but this is still a full-size desktop computer. The new M4 chips are absolute powerhouses. Both the standard and Pro chip now support graphics-intensive work and immersive gaming. The thermal architecture prevents hardware strain and supports intensive tasks for longer. So is it worth it? If you're a content creator, video editor, or looking for a strong desktop, the M4 Mac Mini is a huge win for power in a tiny package. For everyday light users, the M4 may be overkill, but it's a fantastic option if you're ready to invest in serious performance. So what do you think? Is the M4 worth it for you? 